When you're considering which font to use for your publication, and more specifically the body copy, it's essential that you experiment with different font families because none are the same. In the five examples shown here, we have Baskerville, Minion, Sentry, Savannah, and Merriweather. And whilst they're all set at nine points, they do all look different when they're laid out on a page. Take the contrast between Baskerville and Merriweather. Merriweather is a larger looking font at nine points and even looks darker in colour than the other fonts on the page. So never assume that nine points always looks exactly the same from one font family to another. It will vary. The default appearance of text inside of InDesign is set to Minion Pro, regular in style, 12 points in size and 14.4 leading. Now you can alter that at any time with the selection tool active. A single left click on the text frame will make all the text active. You can go to font size where you can tap up or down to change the size of your text. Notice as you do, the leading value will change automatically as well. These options can be found in the properties panel on the right hand side of the screen. However, if you wish to alter the appearance of your text from the control panel, you'll either have to switch to the type tool or you'll have to double left click on the text frame to make your text active. And from there, the typographic options will be shown across the top of the screen. If you select a paragraph with four left clicks or indeed control and A to select all your text in the whole frame, you can then apply the same options from the control panel up at the top. And to find each of these three panels, go to the window menu at the top of the screen where you'll find them all listed in the main menu. And for the character panel, it's found under type and tables. And that's how you can change the size of your text inside of InDesign.